but they're such in good shape that they go for you know an hour or two, and then more people come, and they go for another couple hours, and then pretty soon he's like, whoa, uh, we got to get some some uh, working out, get some cardio. Get <laughs> cardio. <laughs> but I'll tell you something. Um, there's something about praise that um, I like what he said there. You know about the scripture about heaven, you know, being uh, loud. Because sometimes mm-hmm. people are like, well. And we know God's not deaf and he's not nervous. If you're whispering something to God or you're yelling, he hears you, right? But some people are like, well, you don't have to yell at God. He's got to hear you. But you'll see all the way through there, shout with a loud voice. Boom, 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 boom. There's something that happens with that warfare. Come on. It's such a beautiful thing. It yeah, destroys the devil. And um, um, uh, here's, here's the scripture I want to bring to you guys tonight. Matthew 4, 10. It says, away with you, Satan. Say away with you, Satan. Away with you, Satan. Say say Let's say it again. Away with you, Satan. Away, away with you, Satan. Casey, can you say it too? Away with you, Satan. Oh, okay. Wait, go. Say, everybody, where's Kelly? Kelly! Are you here? No. If he's here, I'd say, stay from the bathroom. No. <laughs> away with you, Satan. Away, away with you, Satan. For it is written, you shall worship the Lord your God. Amen. And him only shall you serve. Then the devil left him, and behold, the angels came and ministered to him. Look, um, uh, worship is wonderful. It is an opportunity. And uh, a lot of times um, we have had church services that were so focused on our needs, our wants, our desires, and we hadn't really come in and been a worshipful people to lift the Lord up and worship Him because who He is and what He did. You follow me? So, so, um, does God bring a blessing when you worship? Yeah. Is there a river that flows? Yeah. Does it break the devil's back? Yeah. yeah. But but here's the thing. It's a bad order. We're wanting to just, you know, uh, offer up our love to God for what he's done. I was, I was using the analogy that if, um, you know, sometimes you say, you ask people, well, how was a worship service? And they'll tell you, well, you know what? That one song, I just, it just wasn't my favorite. You know, the one song. And the thing is, is it has nothing to do with what's your favorite or not. Oh, come on. If you're going to ask the Lord how the worship was, don't ask another person. Ask Him. Say, yeah. Lord, did you like the worship? Did oh, it touch your heart? Man. Because it wasn't for you. Mm-hmm. If Reuben had written a love song and he sang it to some lady, <laughs> and Elijah over here is like, man, you know, that song, it was off key. I didn't like the way you put those rhymes together and all that. It had been none of his business because Reuben wasn't writing it or singing it for him. Yeah. He was singing it for his girlfriend. Right. And so when you're singing it and, and, you're, and, you're, and, you're, and you're offering it to the Lord, you know, um, and of course we all have our favorite genres of music, right? And um, I thank God for guys like Todd who makes up for the rest of us in a worship service, you know, <laughs> sounding good. But, um, <laughs> but, the thing is, but the thing is, is that's not what the Lord is looking at. He's listening for each one of his children. That's right. And he wants to hear from mm-hmm. him to mm-hmm. offer praise. And so I just felt led tonight to turn on a little worship. Yeah. We we'll get to teach and we we'll get to word, but oh, a lot, a, a lot of demonic stuff that you and I get hit with, that we try to figure out that we can't see, is just broken Mom, with that. Mom, and and if, if you Mom. can't raise your hands and yell out the name of Jesus, you're bound by devils. Yep. Yep. If uh, you can't yeah. get up and dance, you're Jesus. bound by devils. If you can't, if you can't dance, if you can't shout his name, if you can't, if you, if you're, you know, bottled up. We're going to come over and love you and lay hands on you. And so that way you can get free. And then release it. Sometimes we're in these other countries and we're dealing with such witchcraft that is in a pervaded place where they've, they've done human sacrifices and stuff. Where sometimes the Lord doesn't even have me to pray. He just has me do the warfare worship. Change the atmosphere. Destroys the yoke. Yeah. And so he, he was down there. He was down there in Florida where they just had that hurricane. Category 5. Supposed to wipe things out and became a lunch. And he was saying, hey, now we're going to bring a hurricane of worship. And none of you guys thought God, God moved, but um, away with you, devil. We don't, we don't worship ourselves. We don't worship, you know, um, um, money. We don't worship success. We don't worship... Um, Anything, but we worship God. We worship, Amen. Jesus. That's it. That's it. We worship the Father. So, Amen. Um, he was just giving different biblical foundations. And one thing I love about the Africans is they can teach all of us Americans how to get down. Yeah. Because one thing they do, man, 
is they'll be confronting witchcraft and warlocks that are on another level, and sometimes they don't even rebuke him and stuff. They'll just, like Elijah, some of those guys over there, they'll just have a praise service, and boom. People get delivered, healed, and they never say come out or go. It's just God's glory. Ooh, Amen. Come on. I've seen that. I've seen that. that. Woo! Away with you, devil. Powerful. Now, you, you, come, you come in here, and um, I, I want, I like how he said it, everybody in the sanctuary. So I was going to say to the kids, you know, to Kelly, to Jose, to Casey, to every one of us in, in the background, come on up, dance, pray, sing. But also, too, the Lord doesn't want to show and He doesn't want people to do it that they don't want to. But um, also, uh, we've got to, um, I'm telling you guys something. There's a change, there's a shift come happening on, come on. where okay. it's not going to be, it's not going to be you and I going to worship service and noticing how wonderful the worship band is. Ooh. It's you and I coming to a worship service and the worship's going to leave the stage wow. and it's going to be on the people and they're not going to be looking at a stage. The people are going to be for, before, before the corporates of heaven and they're worshiping tonight. We were worshiping before the courts of heaven yes. and we're a small crowd, but stuff was shifting and breaking yes. and it was changing things. God was turning your hearts tonight in your situation. Amen. In your finances, in your relationship, something happened, and we didn't even pray, we didn't even teach wow. because we were in His presence. Wow. Well, and so, um, it happened. It, ha it happened, and, and it's going to continue to happen. Thank you, Jesus. And uh, Thank you, Jesus. praise the Lord. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But the, thing, the things that we're facing, uh, my friends, we're not going to be able to come against them with natural ability. I say, come on. And I'm going to tell you something. Something maybe just happened in America where people woke up and we voted yesterday. But in my spirit, I feel a peace and a reprieve. But I feel the Lord saying, okay, now the work has just begun. You hadn't changed America. You just got some things broken off. And now we need to get in and we need to fight. And we need to work for uh, a great harvest and a great yeah. revival that will come. Strong as a not as one. Don't don't be don't be like celebrating like we finished. We haven't done anything yet. Come on. We just got out of prison. Come on. We got the Come chains on. broken off yeah. of our nation. Yep. Now it's time to go in. <laughs> get in there and start killing the enemy. Yeah. You know. Yes. Yes. And I'd rather kill the enemy at 300 yards. <laughs> you know, it's <laughs> yeah, safe. Yeah, yeah. You got us in your banette, yeah. banette, banettes and all that. And I was telling the drill sergeant, I'd rather kill him at 300 yards than the press. <laughs> right there. Yeah. But some of the soldiers had done it. Now we don't fight with actual guns. We fight with spiritual uh, armament like worship and prayer. Yeah. Praise the Lord. I pray, Lord, yeah. that uh, yes, we would take this away. Lord, we would just uh, let this uh, worship mentality rest upon us. And Lord, let us, Father God, get into this throughout the day. Yes, yes. Thank you, Lord. Lord, just break off, Father God, the works of the enemy, the, the misunderstandings, yes, Lord. the lies, the, uh, the all the, the heaviness. Lord, let, Father God, your fire, let your freedom, let your liberty, Father God, yes, yes. come and touch, Lord. Yes, and I know, and uh, pray, Lord, for those that aren't sitting here. I pray for family members tonight. I have family members that are bound yes. by yes. a lie of yes. homosexuality. Oh, I have family goodness. members that are bound by a lie that has come in of uh, uh, cross-dressing. I've got family members that are uh, bound in drinking and violence. Yes, you I've got uh, family members, Lord, that are bound with uh, pride and religion. And so, Lord, tonight I release, Father God, your fire, your angels, war angels, yes, ministry yes, angels. Thank you, Lord. I release um, soldiers to go preach the gospel, humans and angels, to Reuben, Jose, Elijah, to Casey, to Todd, to Eric's family. We call in, Lord, right now, by faith, I call in souls. I, I command hearts to be changed. Yes, Lord. Blinders being broken. And freedom in Jesus' name. Jesus, amen. We thank you for it. Thank you for it, Lord. Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I was good. I got a workout. I got a workout. Yeah, me too. I saw Todd go and I was like, oh, I got to 
I gotta step it up. <laughs> I can't let somebody outdo my praise for my God. <laughs> so I had to hit his leg and pray for him. <laughs> Thank God I had no uh... <laughs> Probably got tripped a few times. Praise <laughs> the Lord. Praise <laughs> <laughs> the Bible. Awesome. The Lord is good. Awesome. God bless you guys. Amen. Yeah, you can press the. Uh, I press live on it. So oh. Probably, they're probably like, what are you talking about? <laughs>